I'm Stacy. I'm John. And this is Raw Ability, Ability Life. Life. guys it is for you probably i don't know it was one of the christmas days leading up to christmas or just after christmas this is a pre-recorded video and this is my challenge um i need to make a elf that is an all-inclusive elf what do i mean by all-inclusive elf it is an elf that has disabilities chronic illnesses and sicknesses why would i want to do that why would i want to make an elf sick why would I want to make an elf disabled? Well, because why not? Why not have an elf that is disabled and poorly, just like the kids that are disabled and poorly, or the adults? I want to make an elf that has the same things as my cousin's kids do. So I am going to have an elf that is in a wheelchair that has a catheter for dialysis and a um, Mickey um, peg fe for peg feeding. So, so that is my challenge. It could go all horribly wrong. Okay. In this bag here, I have lots of things. I have three elves. Um, just in case I make a mistake, I've got other ones. Uh, I have old nebulizer tube in. Uh, I think this is going to be very handy for making the catheter, uh, dias catheter and the Mickey. Um, for everybody, if anyone that doesn't know, the Mickey button is where the kids get uh, their feeds from to and their medications. Um, I've currently already started chopping this one up and the reason for that is because I have John working with the iron over there. You can see the steam. <laughs> the smoke. <laughs> okay, you can see the smoke. I have given him four sections of this to melt, um, flatten for me. Uh, to, mm, smells not so nice. So I've got him working on that. I have some of these things because I think these may be handy um, for strengthening some things for the wheelchair. Like this, where I put it for a straw. Just gives it a bit more strength, but it's still a little bit weak. So I may actually change my mind and use some of the tubing instead. But it's a case of fiddling and playing. So I've got plenty of these, but also because I know Matthew likes these, so I'll be taking some to Matthew. I have in here the starts of the wheelchair. I did start pre-cutting out this the other day. I still need to cut some more bits. So I made a start the other day. On That's all I've made a start on. Everything else I'm doing fresh. I've got the glue for that. I have material because I'm making it in material. I want the wheelchair to, I want the wheelchair to last for a long time. I want the whole thing to last for a long time. Um, Greyboard galore because that's what I'm making the wheelchair out of. I just got, I've got loads of different stuff. So we're gonna get on and make this all-inclusive elf and um, hopefully I can make this challenge work because I know that it will be pretty cool for the kids to have an elf that is the same as them. And why not? Why, why can't there be a disabled or sick elf? Why? There's no reason why there shouldn't be, so we're going to do it.
Alright. Trying to drill around this thing is really actually annoyingly hard.
this could all go horribly wrong guys and I'm literally trying to work this out as I go along and I've cut off another tiny tiny little piece and I've curved this around and I'm going to glue this to it Okay, hot glue gun is not working for this. Plastic on plastic, I'm gonna have to use super glue on that. But with this bit, because I wanna put this the other side of um, felt, I'm gonna actually add some super glue to this to make it sure it definitely stays. And then I'm gonna slip this down the side. This is not working for plastic to plastic, the super glue will have to work. It doesn't oh, work I didn't want to try to pull the glue out of the tip, it's, and my fingers stuck together momentarily. Now where's that other little bit? There it is, a tiny little piece. Actually, never mind. Stay down there. Is he saying what? Yes, he is. Both bits are dispatched. There you go, it just says it doesn't. <laughs> she probably doesn't have it yet, but that doesn't mean anything. Okay, so I've super glued them. <gasps> and my fingers. Ah, super glue my fingers! What do you need? Um, I need warm water and quick. Is it hot? It was warm enough to make it come apart. Okay, good. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Honey. <laughs> when do I ever use super glue and not super glue my fingers together? Uh, you know we don't do super glue. Yeah, but whenever I use it, I always super glue my fingers together. John managed to glue this by sanding down something in like the sides to make it rough so that it would stick. So this is finally done and this is going to be the Mickey button the, for their feeding tube. Now we're working on the catheter for the um, dialysis. So we're going to use for this paper straws and plastic straws. So this Mickey button here, it's going to go about here, no, it's going to go about here on the elf. I'm actually, I would have taken this off, but this one, unlike my one, doesn't actually come off, it's stuck to it. So, I'm just going to stick it right in his tummy. How's that look, honey? That looks good. We'll let that dry. Yeah. The problem is I'm going to have here, John, is... Unless I put it directly into the elf, it's going to stick out that much, even with felt. Yeah, I'm just sticking it myself, honey. I'm going to dab it. I'm going to put a tiny hole, stick it in, and then put a bit of super glue. It's actually to the side of the elf. Tiny We're hole. doing surgery! We're doing surgery on the elf! I did put a tiny hole. The <laughs> yeah, elf now has a feeding tube. Right. 
I'll let you glue that. Okay, I had to pop back out again now for a little bit. <laughs> Sorry, Elf. You're, you're very brave, Elf. Very brave, Elf. Okay. Ugh. Okay. Whatever you do. Do not get it on my fingers, I know. Do not touch these bits. Okay. Turn it a little bit. I don't want to put it on the connector. A little bit on that side as well. Right, elf. Braveness again, please. Good elf. Good elf. Now, which way does it? Right, it's that way in the picture. Brave little elf. Good elf. Yeah, I'll give you some more. Put you to sleep. Make sure you're asleep. There we go. Now you've got your good. Mickey bone. Straw's good? Yeah, they're dry. Okay. I just, I just tried twisting them and they already don't twist. Gonna chop that there. I'm gonna fill that end web with hot glue in a second. Now this oh, it's, it, it's a lot bigger and kind of goes slightly sideways there and then attaches down there or yeah. something. Four to it, it is going to be too big. There's nothing I can do about that one. Uh, but we're doing our best. Yeah, exactly. So there's the elf Mickey bun. Pretty cute. I got the start of the wheelchair, I got the foot plates on. Um, they're a little wonky, but they will form into proper place once they get the rest of the framework on. Um, but it's really late, so I'm going to go to bed now and continue with the rest. I'm going to go to bed now and continue with the rest of that and make sure the elf is all okay from his operation tomorrow. So I'll continue on with this tomorrow. He's recovering from his surgery. He's going to stay there overnight. Healing. He should be fine in the morning. We'll check on him in the morning. You will be happy to know that the little elf survived its surgery. He's still smiling. He is still smiling. So he has his Mickey button for his tube feeds and he has his catheter for his dialysis. Um, we were hoping to make a wheelchair for this little guy as well. However, I'm a little concerned about, I knew this, this um, the stuff I used on here possibly would be temporary hold on and I probably have to use pin flare but because I was just trying out the um, paper straws um, <laughs> I didn't want to totally stick it on so I just used temporary plus the temporary thing makes me wheezy too which is really not a good thing because uh, it's in a spray so as you can see they're not sitting right anymore they've kind of moved themselves around it just the, the paper is straws are not strong enough so really I need to use wooden dowels now I'm not going to be able to get wooden dowels in time for tomorrow I'm not so I'm not going to be able to complete the wheelchair for this Christmas so Elfie's going as he is this year and next year he will have a wheelchair but for this year He's going to go without a wheelchair and he will be fine. And then next year I will finish the challenge off by making him a wheelchair. So, we did it. Yes, we did Together. It. Challenge complete. And I only stuck my fingers together one time. Yeah, and I tried to stick my fingers together. <laughs> they stuck together, but I was able to go apart fast enough. So guys, this for you will be Boxing Day. Um, this video is going up on Boxing Day, which means tomorrow is the 27th and we don't have a video recorded for tomorrow, but we are traveling home 
on the 27th so on the 28th you will start seeing videos going up of over what we were actually really doing over Christmas so have a break tomorrow um because on the 28th you're gonna get a lot more videos to watch all in all in one big over the 28th and 29th so we will see you again on the 28th and i hope you all had a wonderful christmas thank you for joining us in our crazy world bye